Today is truly a historical day. Today, boys, we will be looking at the first known sighting of a wild foodist out of his natural habitat, outside in the real world, reacting with actual members of society rather than just sitting in their room with their hands in their pants. I don't know what the actual origins of this video are. Somebody had recently sent this in my Discord and everybody in the discord seemed really interested and wanted me to make a video and that's the most I know about this video. I tried to look for this video other places on YouTube and I couldn't find it so for the moment I believe I am the only channel with this on YouTube although by the time I upload this video that may no longer be the case. I usually don't say stuff like this but recently I've been trying really hard on going for full time on YouTube next summer, so a year from now, and I do believe that this video will probably get demonetized, so if you boys would like to help me out, since this video isn't going to be making any money, please go ahead and like the video and subscribe if you are new. Help your boy go full time at his dream job, that would be absolutely incredible, and with that being said, let's go ahead and check out this wild foodist outside of his natural habitat. Thankfully, this school threat put captions for us because it's going to be hard to understand him throughout this entire video. And also, my apologies for the quality of this video. I don't know what it is with Daniel Foodist Man, but every video I see from him is in like 30 FPS. Bro must be using his mom's dildo or something to record this video. I don't know, but the quality is absolute shit. Black Lives Matter, Black Lives Matter. Do you guys think Black Lives Matter? Yes. You guys think Black Lives Matter? Yeah, Black Lives Matter. Yes. Black Lives Matter. Because yes. swastikas are awesome. Swastikas are the symbol of Black Lives Matter. You see the smile on this freak's face? That right there, that's the look of someone who is soaking up every little inch of attention they can possibly get before they go back home, crawl into their beds and cry themselves to sleep because they realize that the only way they can get attention is by putting a swastika on their chest and walking around dropping the hard R in public and even then, the only attention they are getting is from other social rejects on the internet. I don't know if you boys have been on the Foodison server and saw any of the people they have in that server. Sometimes they post pictures of themselves. I'm not really sure why, but good God, these people are the definition of a Discord moderator. Black power, nigga. Black power. Black power, nigga. Black power, nigga. Black power, nigga. Nigger, 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 nigger. Nigger, nigger. Black la matter. Black la matter. Black la matter. Black la matter, nigger. Black la matter. Did you boys see how much his hand was shaking when that guy told him he needed to cut that out? It looked like a fucking earthquake was happening for a second. Daniel Foodist Man was fucking shitting himself. He was not about to let this guy get anywhere near him. What he didn't show you is before he turned the camera off, bro booked it six blocks the other way so this guy couldn't find him and beat his ass. In all seriousness though, shout out to this guy for not falling for Daniel Foodist Man bullshit and punch him in his face because we all know Daniel Foodist Man is the type of kid to go around doing shit like this, get his ass beat, and then press charges. That's just how people like this work. This is the simple Black Lives Matter, nigga. This is the simple Black Lives Matter. You need to stop being Jewish! Black Lives Matter! Black Lives Matter! Black Lives Matter! I love how at the end right there, nobody is even paying any attention to him except for a couple of people who are standing in the background just staring at him, probably wondering what the fuck his issue is. That right there though is where the video ends, or at least the portion of the video that I have. Again, I don't know where this original video comes from. I'm assuming there's more to this video than what I have, but 
it. This was all that was sent to me. If you boys didn't know, my last Daniel Foodist Man video got taken down off of YouTube for child endangerment for something that I had in the video that was completely separate from Daniel Foodist Man. So definitely drop a like on this video. This is the first Daniel Foodist Man video I've made since the original one. And the original one was doing pretty good on my channel. I'm not gonna lie. I was pretty upset when that one got taken down. So again, drop a like for your boy if you enjoyed this video. I don't know what the fuck is wrong with Daniel Foodist Man. The kid is an absolute freak. I don't know if you boys remember the last Daniel Foodist Man video, but his fucking room was torn to shreds. Bro had holes all up in his walls. His bed had no fucking sheets on it. It was absolutely disgusting. I don't know what the fuck is wrong with the kid, but without a doubt, him and Foodison are prestige master level 1000 school threats. It's not even a question at this point. With all that being said though, thank you boys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed the video, drop a like on the video. Like I said, comment down in the comment section. Help your boy get pushed deeper into people's recommended. Go ahead and subscribe over to my streaming channel. Your boy is trying so hard to upload more often. So thank you so much for watching the videos and thank you so much to my members, JC and that archive guy. You two are absolutely insane and I thank you so incredibly much. With all that being said, boys, I will see you in the next one. Peace.